Uh, two has lost too much weight. People hate it. Here's Jalen Waddle chit chatting about Tua being super skinny now. You know, I told him I miss Chubby Tua, man. <laughs> I miss Chubby Tua, man. I ain't gonna lie. I didn't like it when I seen it. I told him I'm not, I'm not with it. I told him, I told him straight up, I'm not, I'm not with it. Eat some more or something, man. He's, yeah, I'm not. Yeah, facts. Hair twisted and some more. I'm not. Nah. <laughs> I'm loving it though. He's, he's looking good, feeling good, and um, got to throw with him a lot this offseason, so he, he's looking good. So that's now Jalen and Tua both going like, whole new Tua this year. What did Tyreek say? Tyreek said, uh, thought he was on. Uh, he said, is this guy on Ozempic? He was at uh, Pro Bowl, fat as shit. Yeah. And then all of a sudden he's super. Remember, he's got great jawline right now. Yep. Mm -hmm. His hair kind of froed up a little mm -hmm. bit. New tat, whole new arm tatted up. Super thin, more agile. AJ, they're saying he's going to extend plays and make the Miami Dolphins offense even more lethal. Skinny Tua. I guess, have we heard from Tua yet? I'd like to know if he had a plan going into this offseason, like, hey, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to lose 10, 15 pounds, whatever it may be. But you know the first time he comes out of a game injured, if he does, I, I, I don't wish anyone to get hurt. But if, he, if he's limping ever once, that's the first thing people say, oh, maybe he needs to put that weight back on. Uh, I can't wait to see how Tua handles the weight loss and also how he continues to evolve his look. Yeah. Ooses look cool all the time. They do. They literally look cool all the time. All shapes, all sizes. Ooses look cool all the time. Tua now getting jocked, double tat, hair's growing out long. I think we have a chance to maybe have coolest looking guy to ever play quarterback ahead. Not right now, obviously. Okay. And I think that's what a lot of people are saying. I think that's what Jalen's saying, too. Jalen's like, hey, we need to get there. He brings in a beard into this entire equation. That's the thing. He needs to grow the beard back because his beard, I mean, like you mentioned it, the Usas, they're always, it's so lined up. It looks so good every time. Roman Reigns, all you know, the Uso brothers, all the guys in the WWE, their beards are phenomenal, okay? Tua needs to get the, because it just looks weird. It just looks weird. You, you have that type of hair. If you have a nice, you know, tight beard with it as well, yeah. we are talking coolest looking QB ever. We have some big time NFL news. Potential friend of yours, Corey Lindsley, has been released oh. uh, from the Chargers. Chargers. New regime, Jim Harbaugh loves offensive line. Thought there was maybe a chance that you would still in, keep the vet around who's getting paid very well to be the center for the Chargers. He uh, he was released, and now they're talking about retirement and all the records that are coming out. 1,572 straight pass block snaps without allowing a sack. Obviously, Aaron loves this guy. I assume everybody in Green Bay does. AJ, what are your thoughts on Corey and the potential end of the road here, which goes back to the conversation about Jordan Love saying, hey, it feels like our locker room's tighter than it's ever been because this is like their team now. Yeah. That previous team is seemingly, you know, yeah, the light at the end of the tunnel is some kind of there for everybody, AJ. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if anyone like Bakhtiari might have been the last of that kind of era. I think in Green Bay, him and and Mason Crosby, and they're they're not there uh, anymore. But yeah, Corey Lindsay, he is such a unique, weird, awesome dude. Like, okay, what do you mean by weird? one of those yeah. like weird? He watches weird movies. Uh, super intelligent. Like, you, if you you'd say, hey, Corey, hey, tell me what's going on Israel Palestine. What's happening? He'll legit could tell you for twenty minutes. He'll go back to. 3,000 years ago. I mean, yeah, he needs to start watching more film. Yeah, that's what that's I'm, a hard you know what I'm saying. Football wise, too. Like, he, he hey, is. Corey, I don't want to hear it. Corey's like right? a weird genius and uh, and one of those, like, country strong kids at the same time. So, great combination for a center. Hey, Corey, what? congratulations if it is it. Yeah. If not, can't wait to he see. He's about 190 pounds right now. Where are you heading next? Yeah. Oh, he really? He's already on his I transition. Mean, super, super lean. Yeah. What if he was talking about, like, Terrence Howard and Jim Harbaugh heard him? And he's I like, would like to ask Corey, hey, what do you think about this whole Terrence Howard situation? Because he'd have, he'd give you a 40-minute thing on every single thing. Terrible. When did you see him? He's 195 pounds. The Derby. Okay, so that could have been some news. Hey, Corey Lindsley, center, guy who's one of the most world-renowned tough guys. He's now 185 He's not pounds. But I don't know what he is.